Hello everyone. In this video, we are going to see how to fetch pick, custom pick list field values dynamically in Salesforce flow. For this demo, I created a record triggered flow. So this trigger will be called whenever an account record is created or updated. Next, I have a get records element. I am using field definition object and then I am fetching uh, the field definition record for account object and active underscore underscore C which is a uh, custom pick list field. So this is my pick list field for active which is a custom field. It has no and yes, two values. So first I'm fetching the field definition for account objects active underscore underscore pick list field. I'm getting only the first record and I'm just making sure Salesforce stores the record. Next I'm using another get records and and this time I'm fetching it from pick list value info where entity particle id is equal to the previous field definition dot durable id so this is very very important so the match the mapping should be entity particle id with field definitions durable id here i am just getting id and value there are additional fields like label uh, and other additional parameters are also there you can add if you are looking for additional information and next I'm using loop element and then I'm iterating each and every values from the active pick list field values. So from this get records I'm iterating each and every record and then I'm just adding it to a custom active value which is a uh, um, custom variable and then I'm setting it to current uh, item from the loop and its value. So now let me debug it so here i should be able to see no value and also yes value so first we have to fetch from field definition object or entity and the next step is we have to fetch it from pick list value info object or entity. Please check the video description. You will get screenshots from my blog post which will help you to develop the same flow. I hope it was helpful. Thank you for watching.